Hello everyone, and today we're going to be taking a look at the Logitech K760 keyboard. Um, this is a wireless solar keyboard, which is pretty much what makes it stand out. It's predominantly um, for iOS and Mac devices, but as I'm going to show you later on in the video, it works pretty much flawlessly um, with Windows as well. You can pick this up for, um, well, I picked it up for £39 off Amazon, which is a super great deal for a really premium quality keyboard. So I've just sped up me unboxing it for you guys quickly. Um, you don't really get much of the packaging, literally just the keyboard itself, which is super clean and super sleek looking, and then just the normal leaflets that nobody reads. Um, and I've also just left in this clip here of me peeling off the plastic, because we all know that is a pretty good sound. And it reveals this um, really interesting, this black um, solar panels, which is what makes this device different. It charges from natural and um, artificial light, and I, so you basically never run out of charge. It's raised by these two um, rubber-backed sort of um, feet at the bottom, and it really is raised just as much as you need it to be. Here's just a quick size comparison, so you can just roughly see how big it is. Also, it just looks super great on a desk and super clean. What I'm gonna show you guys now is just how simple it is to set up this keyboard. So for an iPad, we're just gonna go ahead and hit the on switch on there. We're gonna press which key we want to assign to the device, and I've just chosen one, and that'll turn on the Bluetooth. We hit the Bluetooth button, turn that on, and then the keyboard should come up straight away. Once we've connected to that, you can just go on something like Pages, just, just so I can show you that it does work, and obviously there's no lag whatsoever, and that is literally taking like seconds to start up. You can assign this to up to three devices, and my second device is going to be my um, Windows laptop. Again, pretty much the same procedure. Turn it on, press the button that you want to assign it to, so for this one I've just chosen two. I actually just went in and typed in Bluetooth down at the start menu, um, but it might just come up automatically by itself and basically it will recognize that the keyboard or device whatever is there then it will ask you to type in a code just so you can pair it which is pretty simple to do then you'll see it will start to install and once this has happened it honestly just works flawlessly like I had didn't have to remap any any of the keys um, the command key works straight away as the windows key all the sound functions worked, all the brightness functions worked. I honestly had to do nothing to make it work with Windows. So obviously, as you can see, this is definitely not just for iOS and Mac, but also does work perfectly on those platforms as well. Um, pretty much overall, this is just a great device, especially for the price. And if you're looking for something that is really sleek, and is going to keep all that clutter off your desk, and this is definitely the keyboard for you. Okay, guys, so thanks for watching. If you have any questions, then feel free to leave a comment. Please like and subscribe, and I'll be back with another video soon. Bye!